Good afternoon, it's Tony again for Paranormal Investigation UK and we're looking today at the fourth of the five CCTV alarms that is coming on the Chester case that have been running since May of 2020. Um, this is five alarms that occurred over about a one hour, 20 minute basis. Um, I'll quickly recap to what we've got, we've done so far. Let's look back to... Yeah, it's at 3.06, which is the first time is 20.33, followed by the second alarm, which occurred at 20.44, and the third one was 21.09, and we're now onto the fourth one, which is 21.23. So if you're following these these five, I don't need to go any any further than that. Uh, what we're going to do is analyse this first rap sound, which I presume is a rap sound, because the other three certainly were. Uh, make sure there's nothing going on, and then we'll review the rest of the, the footage. The third movie we did, the one before this, which is movie 307, three, I think. Get that number right. Sorry, 308. Just had the wrapping with nothing followed. The, the two before had EVP ish, rappy sounds going on together with some infrasound that occurred on the first one, but not subsequent ones, which makes the analysts of these movies a, a little bit different because there's unusual stuff going on in there which we can't find. Um, such a small space where this camera is situated anyway uh, let's look at this first one I've got no volume whatsoever it's not amplified so I'm just going to look at this one first yeah it's rap sounding but it's not um, a typical rap which you come to expect there's the frequency there. It's certainly similar to the ones that uh, they were did before. So what we're going to do is take a screenshot of that. Say that. It's. I'm not convinced it's what the, the rap sound that we've experienced literally 900 and all the thousand unexplained raps in this building. The raps tended to be a very tight. 800 to a thousand hertz which is where i've got my cursor almost like a big chimney sticking up this is different and i think there's still quite a strong possibility of being a rational reason why what cause the sound although we at the moment investigations with the owner have found absolutely nothing there's no uh, timer there's no clock in there anything mechanical that would give an explanation for the sound we simply don't know what it is the camera is not mechanical, it's a fixed camera, so that's not making the sound. So at the moment, we're not, just simply not sure. So at the moment, all I can do is just simply record it. And hopefully at some point, we'll, we can maybe be able to find either a rational reason or a paranormal one, if that's the case. So so I've saved that. I want to take the loop off. Now I'll, I'll amplify it. Take it to about seven or eight decibel extra. That's about three times as loud. And listen to the rest of it front to back while looking at the um, the CCTV. Um, I'm just going to bring the analyzer up. So if there's anything sound-wise that comes in, this should uh, well it, it will it will it will react to it. So we've got keep an eye on the video as well as the the audio. Okay. 
the blowing sound that's just simply uh, acoustic feedback from t amplifying the the audio ah now that is rapid yeah okay nothing to be seen we shut that down there a minute I don't think we're going to hear that on low volume. Yes, we can. So I can be confident it's within the room. I don't understand why we're not getting a fix on this. That should pick it up. I don't understand why it's not picking it up. Just there. Okay, this has suddenly just jumped into life. I don't understand why it's not reacting. Just pop it in there. Going one. Now it is. Must be some sort of conflict. It's 
too slow. Low power. Yeah, I can I can hear it and the fade is reacting to the sound. Um, but certainly rap rap sounding. I just don't seem to be able to get a a frequency fix. Okay, what I'm actually gonna do is take the unusual step of closing this down and restarting again. It's at uh, 24 seconds. Just to rule out any sort of um, software problem. So it's there. Oops. Yeah. Quite strange because the the fade itself is reacting over for a signal. It's barely, barely there. Okay, we've got a, a fix on that. Okay, we'll call it that one. It's, it's certainly rat territory. That it's just some of the sounds that we've that we've got. I've done so so many nine hundred a thousand probably raps in this building that <clears throat> the others stood out as being different. The, the frequency was completely um, over to the right hand side. So okay, we've got that. We can record that up. Um, Quite strange about because although you can hear it and it does sound relatively loud, there doesn't seem to be much of a frequency fix on that. So it's a strange one. Okay, listen to the rest of it. Pick the screen up, make sure we're not missing anything.
Okay, turn that back up. That's the frequency. So low volume. Um, on the on the maximum here. I'm on maximum now. Can't hear that on normal volume, so we can't really exclude outside. We still don't hear it there, so I'll record it anyway. Take the loop off, listen to the rest of it. Near the end now, anyway. that back flap later right <clears throat> so what we've got there is um, certainly got loud bang followed by a very distinct rappy sound um, the raps are more interesting because although we can hear it the frequency can sometimes be incredibly difficult to get a fix on and it's almost as if it's devoid of any power frequency wise although you can actually hear it it sounds a bit irish that but um it's an unusual one when you compare to the the bands you get in earlier very easy you can you can hear it um yeah and the raps don't seem to have much frequency within it um so okay see you on the next movie